Oh yeah, it's that time of year once again. The Red River Showdown, Oklahoma and Texas, Saturday noon Eastern from the Cotton Bowl in Dallas. Oklahoma opened as a three point favorite here. That's been bet up to three and a half. Total open 63 and a half. No changes on that front. Still 63 and a half at the time of this recording. I am going to back the Longhorns. Give me the three and a half points here. Texas went down to Arkansas in week two, right? They come out, it's the Steve Sarkeesian era. They beat a ranked Louisiana team to start. They get people gassed up. They lose at Arkansas. Everybody jumps off the train, right? Okay, everybody's off the train. But two things about that jump. Number one, turns out Arkansas is actually pretty good, right? Yes, they got shellacked by Georgia. Who wouldn't get shellacked by Georgia? Right, but this is a pretty formidable Arkansas team. And number two, Texas has been really good since that defeat. They've won every single game. In fact, Texas's offense currently ranks fifth in the country in scoring. They're averaging over 40 points per game. They can put the ball in the air. They can put the ball in the end zone, all right? I think it's time that we start looking at Oklahoma and we ask ourselves, is something wrong with the Sooners, right? Maybe not drastically wrong because they are five and oh, but this isn't really what we expected a five point win over Tulane, a seven point win over Nebraska, a three point win over West Virginia, and a six point win over Kansas State last weekend. Oklahoma's only covered the spread one time this year. It was against Western Carolina. And in this rivalry, they've only covered the spread twice in the last nine meetings. I think it's a tightly contested affair, but ultimately, I'm gonna play Texas plus three and a half.